Well, as we uh, went through our Tuesday, it was a cold one. As a matter of fact, we started off the day with record low temperatures in the Quad Cities, Dubuque and Burlington. And in the afternoon, uh, because we stayed so cold, we set new record cold high temperatures. Same three places, the Quad Cities officially, also Burlington and Dubuque. Well, as we go through the night, interestingly enough, our temperatures will do a little bit of a turnaround, easy for me to say. And as we get these clouds to move in, the temperatures will actually start to rise through the night very gradually, but we should be well into the upper teens to near 20 by daybreak on Wednesday. Another thing coming our way besides the clouds will be a little bit of snow, but that's not until later in the afternoon at the earliest. As we start our Wednesday, mostly cloudy skies, those clouds continue to thicken during the day and as we finish off the afternoon we'll be looking to the north at some snow that will be forming and then that snow will quickly be shifting through the area as we go through the evening hours all done by midnight so we're not going to get the snow to stick around for a long time that's why we're not looking at uh, much in terms of accumulation but if you are out later tomorrow into the evening especially be careful on those roads especially north of interstate 80 where the heaviest of snow will fall and it's not going to be that heavy we're only talking about an inch to two inches off to the south of Interstate 80. For many of us, a dusting to about an inch and where temperatures could be warm enough to support perhaps a mix, we could see that developing south of Highway 34. High temperatures during the day, well, they'll get back to the mid-20s along Highway 20, close to 30 or a little above 30 along the Interstate 80 corridor. Off to the south, this is where we'll find the warmest weather for the day. And of course, we use that term loosely when we're looking at high temperatures, some 20 degrees below average, a low to mid-30s south of Interstate 80 here in the metro officially will go for a high of about 31 degrees cloudy and windy. Those wind gusts of 25 miles per hour could in open areas lead to some snow blowing back over the roads, uh, generally about an inch or so of snow with wind chills climbing through the day. And as we look beyond tomorrow at the seven day forecast, a little bit of moderation in our temperatures toward the weekend. 33 Thursday, 37 Friday, low 40s for the weekend, and then we'll be back to near 50 by Tuesday.